Uh, taking home the BAFTA for best reality and constructive factual, the team behind I'm a Celebrity, get me out of here. Yay. You got yourself another BAFTA. Last time you won was in 2003. I know. 16 years later. We've been slacking since 2003. <laughs> really should have pulled our socks off. Yeah, who, who, who made the, the, it a tight shift? Who got you guys in ship shape to get this uh, BAFTA? It's, uh, it's, it's Holly. It's obviously Holly. Spot the newcomer. She's made us all pull our socks up. Um, no, it's amazing. This is for Series 18. Wow. Of, of I'm a celebrity, you know, and to, to get to Series 18 is, is an accomplishment itself. Mm. But to get a BAFTA for it, you know, we're absolutely thrilled. And Holly, what a joy to join this show oh, and to get a BAFTA for it. I know, it. it's amazing. I mean, just sort of, I love the show. I'm a huge fan of the show. And to be able to sort of see it firsthand and actually be there, you sort of felt like you jumped into your screen. And then to win one of these is like amazing. It, it just doesn't feel real. It doesn't feel real. It's really happening. You've definitely won the I BAFTA. Know, I promise. Um, so your wonderful team. I mean, how do you keep coming up with the different things for the celebrities to do? Because I just don't, I, every series you just think, okay, what else, what else can be done? And then all of a sudden someone's eating something weird. Yeah. <laughs> or, or in a room doing something strange. I think the key is the team. There mm -hmm. is the most amazing team that works on this show. Um, there's sort of up to about 700 people when wow. we're fully going. Mm. Um, Ooh, okay. And then there are all, every trial that you see has been through tests, thoroughly tested by uh, lots of producers who've been through and taken the pain so the celebrities know it's safe. So it's just the most amazing team uh, who come up with all of those ideas. And they all deserve to be here holding one of these because they are amazing. But you'd never get them in this little space. <laughs> here. This little would, space next to the toilet. Yeah, it, it would be a bit of a tight squeeze. I mean, <laughs> this is a show that celebrities genuinely really want to go on for the challenge in itself. Could you tell that I to don't all know of why. them? <laughs> <laughs> There's who a few we're still trying for. <laughs> a lot of people want to come on this show no, because it's, it's really transformative, isn't it? You see, you essentially see character arcs in reality TV. Like, what's what's been, I guess, one of the more touching moments you've seen on the show well, besides year, the crazy I think stuff? Especially, they all seem to just get on really, really mm. well. Like, they very much bonded as a team. Um, and I think the, also the other thing that I noticed that I, and obviously it looks very beautiful that it's in the jungle, nature, and the rest of it. But when you walk into that camp, it's a really special place. Like, it's a bit magical. So I think you, you don't really. I, I, did, I did. I do, I do cry about me. everything, but I do. You're such a bitch. Oh my god! That is okay. You had you felt emotional. I like, do. Connected I do. to the work. A yeah. true broadcaster. Oh, oh, oh. She's crying. She has. Crying. She's barely slept for jungle. three weeks. She's crying. <laughs> um, what are the plans for the next series? Uh, another cast that sort of is going to blow everyone away and uh, <laughs> more trials, more variations of torturing people in a very kind and entertainment friendly way. <laughs> and on that note, we absolutely cannot wait. Guys, congratulations once again on your BAFTA. Thank you. Have an amazing time celebrating. Thanks very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.